Hi everybody, today is July 10th, 2013. Former Fukushima nuclear plant boss dies of cancer. The former boss of the Fukushima nuclear power plant, who stayed at his post to try to tame the reactors after Japan's earthquake and tsunami, has died of throat cancer. Masho Ishida, 58, was at the Japanese power station on March 11, 2011, when towering waves swamped cooling systems and sparked meltdowns or released plumes of radiation. Yoshida led the subsequent effort to get the crippled complex under control as workers battled frequent aftershocks to try and prevent disaster worsening. Government contingency plans revealed after the event showed how scientists feared a chain reaction if Fukushima spiraled out of control. A scenario that could have seen other nuclear plants engulfed and would have meant evacuating Tokyo. His selfless work is contrasted in the public's mind with the attitude of his public employees who seem willing to abandon the complex and are properly believed to have shrank their responsibility. He died of esophageal cancer at 11.32 a.m. today at a Tokyo hospital, said a spokesman for the plant operator, TEPCO, Tokyo Electric Power Company. Yoshida left the plant soon after being suddenly admitted to hospital in late November of 2011. TEPCO has said his cancer was unlikely to be linked to radiation exposure in the months after the disaster. The company has said it would take at least five years and normally ten years to develop this particular condition if radiation exposure were to blame. Soon after he underwent surgery for cancer, Yoshida was felled by a brain hemorrhage and underwent another operation in July 2012, TEPCO said. He was still employed by the company at the time of his death. The disaster saw three reactors go into meltdown, spewing radiation into the air, sea, and food chain in the worst nuclear accidents since the 1986 Chernobyl disaster. No deaths have been directly attributed to the radiation released by the accident, but has displaced tens of thousands of people and left large areas of land uninhabitable, possibly for decades. And it's going to be much longer than decades, probably thousands of years. All right, well, bookmark my site. I'll keep you up to date. Please stay safe, and I'll talk to you later. God bless you all.